So someone wanted to know, how do you deal with being alone? And I guess this is because of the quarantine shit that's going on. Man, don't let that solitude take over. If you've been cooped up in your place during this quarantine, man, get your ass outside, go for a walk, go for a run, take your ass and get some sun. Get out there, bro. Just get your ass out there. But I know we're still on this social distancing thing, right? And that's not necessarily a bad thing. See, this guy that asks about how to deal with being alone, the problem is you see it as a negative thing. You see it as a negative thing, bro. There are plenty of positives that could come out of this. You in the perfect place right now to really get on your fucking grind. You in the perfect place to come out with new creative ideas, to figure out how to scale your business. It's the perfect time to plan your next moves. This quarantine ain't finna last forever. It's not gonna be permanent social distancing. But I'ma tell you one thing. This might be the perfect time for you to take that social distancing and apply that shit to the people in your life that are just a detriment to you, bro. The people that's just bringing you down. Those need to be permanent. That's permanent social distancing. Permanently. They need to be gone. This is the perfect time for you to separate, okay, the people that you want to deal with once this shit is over and it's lifted and you hanging out with people again, you going out again. Who are the people in your life that you knew you should have been cut off? Who are the people in your life you was like, you know what, man, I need to stop fucking with him. I need to stop dealing with her. There's plenty of people out there. You ain't cut them all off. I know you have. If you feeling negative, you get negative vibes from people, this is the perfect time for you to correct that shit. Check. Gone. They got to be out of there. It's time right now, man. And you know what? Things that you've been thinking about doing, I'm telling y'all something. The things that you've been thinking about, like, okay, I'm thinking about starting this business or this is a good idea. This is a time for you to brainstorm right now and get something off the ground, man. Get something off the ground. Start making efforts towards something, something new. Try something new. You tired of doing the same old shit? No wonder you feel lonely. You're doing the same shit. Everybody done moved on to other shit. You by yourself. You're still stagnant. You're still at this level right here. Everybody continuing to move up around you. If you're around the right people, they shouldn't be stagnant. If you're slowing down and you know you're the only one slowing down, man, it's time for you to rise up. Rise up to the challenge, bro. Stop wasting time. You got the perfect amount of time right here, right now to make something happen. Instead of seeing it as being lonely, oh, I'm lonely, I'm by myself. Stop looking at it like that. You the one making it negative. That's a positive to me. Finally, I get time to just chill out. Finally, I get time to just clear my mind and think about what I got to do. Focus on me. Become better. All the flaws that I got, time for me to work on them. Time for me to meditate and get on my shit. That's the perfect time for you to do that. Stop looking at shit negatively. How about you sit there and figure out why you're looking at shit negatively? Why are you even lonely? What's the feeling of being lonely, bruh? That's the feeling of you need to get up and do something. That's the feeling of something missing, right? What's missing is you not being on your purpose. I just feel like I'm alone. I feel like I'm down and out. Some bullshit like that. I call it bullshit because it is bullshit. And I'm going to tell you why. Because the same people that say that, they will sit here and try to find their happiness in other people. They will think, oh, I got to be in a relationship to be happy. I remember when I was with my ex, I was happy when I was with her. Nigga, that's delusion. That is straight up delusions in your head. You cannot put your happiness on somebody else. Just because she laying in bed with you doesn't mean that you ain't alone. You can still be alone laying in bed. You can be in a room full of people and you still alone. Is that necessarily a bad thing? Why you look at it as a bad thing? You just different. Reason why you feel like that, you ain't found your mission in life. That's what's missing. It ain't that peace. Oh, I need her in my life. That's not the case, bro. You ain't found your mission in life. And I can't sit here and tell you what your mission is, bro. I can't come out the gate and say, oh, this is what you need to be doing. You need to be doing this. Everybody different. Everybody different. Nigga, this is what you need to be doing, bro. Do this shit. What the fuck I look like? You got to ask yourself that. You got to really go inside and ask yourself that shit. What, you need people around you to feel like you're doing something? You need a distraction from your life? See, that's what this social distancing thing is doing. This quarantine, that's what it's really doing. It's forcing people to look themselves in a the mirror and be like, you know what? I got shit I need to work on. 
So guess what? You got to ask yourself that. You got to take that internal trip. You're the only one that can do that.